From the Kakanda deposit in the Congo, we have a matrix of a dolomite slat, um, almost little dendritic formations of heterogenite on the back, and then perched right across the top. I'd actually have this guy on the stand. So standing on the stand, this would be the sideways view. There's a whole mountains, mountains and valleys of things happening on top here. And when we have a closer look, you have these formations of malachite, little almost needles of malachite compacted together uh, to, to look like malachite perhaps after azurite or uh, I'm not quite sure, pseudomorphing definitely. Associations on this material from Kakanda, I'd also expect to find some quartz in some cases and uh, of course the cobalt and calcite is the predominant matrix, sort of a grey pink in colour heterogenite and the occasional Kulweza, I don't see any on this particular piece. Also quite nice, I'll just show you on the cross sections here, you see the, the there's color zoning on the cobalt and calcite crystals, so the, the color is concentrated on the outside and sort of enters the middle on a, a bit of a yellowish formation. Oh, and there seem to be tiny traces of chrysocolla across some sections here as well. Little powdery dusting of chrysocolla. All the way from the Kakanda deposit in the Katanga. Um, palm size specimen. Lovely piece. Um, really not at all photogenic. Here's a better look of what it actually looks like. Um, the, this pink doesn't show off nicely on the, on the photos. It's actually very, very appealing material. Very busy. Lots of things happening here. And this section is pretty contact-free also.